Welcome back to the regular vlogs. I think it's 5.44 or 5.45, I don't really know. 76 degrees, we've got a lovely day on the way to the pool right now. It's about 12.03 p.m., welcome. I'll talk more about the Kent State experience tonight, maybe, or tomorrow, or sometime when I have time in the vlog, but just stunning out here, so we're gonna go lounge for a while, soak up the rays, and I don't really know what else is going on. I was supposed to stay there till noon today, but I kinda left at nine, I had all the stuff done, so I just snuck out, but, all right, time to go, talk to you in a bit. Must be too early for him. It's, it's 80, there's only two people in the pool. Yeah, that's true, we do have our choice of chairs. And welcome home. I didn't film anything at the pool. It was it was chill. The water was a little cool. And the process behind that is... I'm straightening out the eagle on my flag there. Nice and straight. Um, they open Memorial Day weekend, right? So they, they heat the water up. It's nice Memorial Day weekend. And then nobody really comes back during the week in volume for 10 days or two weeks. You know, everybody's still in school. So they kind of let the water dip down back into the 70s and it's cold. So it was really cold Wednesday. Today when we got there is a little better. By the time we left, it was better yet. So hopefully this weekend, they'll keep the water temperature up, put the money into it, and it'll pay off because there's just a lot more people going. Anyways, pool was a success. So now I'm home and the cat's hungry again. I got dinner coming in in a little bit and then we're going over for a bonfire at Kennan's tonight. And uh, I'm running on five, six hours of sleep for the past two days. I feel good right now, but I'm gonna crash early tonight, so. Uh, there may not be a whole lot more in this video. We'll see. Still beautiful though, about 85 and kind of a layer of haze up there, but it's still very sunny, so no complaints. Yeah, yeah Kenan doesn't need college. So this is all his stuff from his junior year and we're gonna, we're gonna downsize it. Is there water in there? This is so weird. T Taylor, Taylor, clean, did you get your exhaust cleaned out? Let's hear it. Yeah, give it a <laughs> <laughs> Oh All right, back it up, bud. Kenan and, and Jasko are switching spots right now. Hey, Jack, how are you? Oh, you didn't, I definitely didn't just say that last sentence. Uh-huh, and, and, what? Nothing. They're switching, oh, clever. Is he gonna back in? Yeah, he's gonna oh, back yeah. in. He's gonna be like, look how much smaller the focus is than the Odyssey. With size comes power, sometimes. Yeah, not, not in this case. As long as he doesn't mess up. Yeah, keep an eye on it. You're good, you're good, you're good. Yep, and here he comes with, with the camera. He can see me. <laughs> really hard to drive in these. Wait, wait, do the foot. Oh my god! Alright, we've got limited light out here, but Kenan's, uh, he's practicing. Jack and Taylor just made it. And uh, there is my senior year, so we're gonna eliminate that. Yeah, but when you light that on fire, it's gonna come up in your whole hand. Right. No, it won't. I don't want to see him burn his hand off. Alright, I don't right. like him either, let's, but... Let's do it Day here. two. Taylor's crap. Or Ryan's crap now. Taylor's still gonna light it. Jack's still on rocks. These matches are awful! And so is the rest of that. I'm so surprised that didn't just totally blow, go. Didn't yeah. blow up. Give it time. Give oh, it there time. There it goes. Oh, there it is. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> there it goes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it works now. <laughs> Alright, oh, now we need wow. to keep that alive. <laughs> oh, okay. Well. Holy that's, a okay. <laughs> that's, that's a little high. Now we get his papers away. That's a little high. Throw those in there. Okay. <laughs> Alright. You may do the honors, Mr. Jesco. Don't get it near me. Nice. Oh, <laughs> shit. That's good. That's good. Ready? Yes, Canada, sir. Back away. Oh, <laughs> that's a good one. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> that's a damn good one. We're lighting up the entire area. That's awesome. Very nice. Hey guys, it's 1:14 in the morning. Um, I said I was gonna crash sometime tonight, and I'm feeling that come. I'm feeling that coming on strong. Does that make sense? I don't even know. Um, five hours of sleep over the past two days. That's not five hours a night. That's like four hours one night and an hour last night. And uh, I'm still alive right now. I still know where I am. I'm facing southwest right now. Southwest. That's right. Um, 
Yeah, so I'm gonna go in and put this together and I don't think I'm gonna get anything else done tonight aside from importing, rendering, editing, exporting, and uploading. And uh, we'll hope I get that done. Tomorrow, usually I go over to the grandparents' house at nine o'clock. Tomorrow I moved it to 10. I'm gonna need the sleep. Once I fall asleep in probably 45 minutes, I'm gonna wanna sleep till like two. So um, we'll get an extra hour having a grad party Sunday, so I'm helping them. It's gonna be at their house, doing a lot of work over there. And I wanted to talk about a couple um, emails I got from yesterday's vlog, which I actually filmed in here, obviously, a couple nights ago. Uh, everybody said, uh, what happened to UCLA? Aren't you going to school in California? And I thought I outlined this um, a little better in March, but um, obviously it's been a while, so I'll kind of go over the plan again. Um, the first two years of college, basically, no matter where you go, are essentially the same. You do your core credits. You get your humanities and the basic stuff out of the way. Those are the first two years. You know, you still have to take a science, a math, uh, and, and a, a bunch of other crap. It's like two years of high school, kind of, again. So my plans are, why can't I live here where, honestly, I live for cheap. Uh, I get a garage space. I get a nice house to live in. I have friends and family nearby and I can drive 15 minutes and go to school and get all that basic stuff done for a third the price it's gonna be in California. So my plan is to go here for two years, get all my basic credits done, figure out what I wanna do and how I wanna do it, and then move to the school that I wanna graduate from. So two years at Kent State University, it's one of the top 200 universities in the world, I think it's around 140. Um, it's a good school, it's not expensive, it's close by, and I can live here, which is awesome. And after spending a night in a college dorm last night, there is no way I'm ever going to be able to live on campus. I can't do it for me. I just That's not my lifestyle, that's not what I can do. And I, I know that I won't be productive and successful living on a college campus. So I'm going to be here for the next year to two, probably two. I got my classes all set up, I have three semesters planned, obviously it's all changeable. Uh, I start August 27th at Kent. It looks good. I'll talk more about how everything went over the past day and a half, two days, um, at a later time. But that's the plan. Now, what school in California? So two years, I'll move out there. And uh, there's mosquitoes out here. Hopefully, we can establish residency somehow out there because if you have a property, if you live in the state of California for a year, before you start school, it is a lot cheaper. And by a lot cheaper, I mean half. So instead of 50,000, it'll be 25,000, which is a lot of money saved. So that's the plan. So as I said before, what school in California? I looked at UCLA. Uh, I love Los Angeles as a city. It is a great place to go and visit. I can't wait to go back. But I don't know if I can see myself living there. It's a big urban concrete jungle, and that's not the kind of city I like. Two hours south of Los Angeles is San Diego. It's beautiful. It is the eighth largest city in the United States. It is the safest largest, uh, it's the safest urban city in the United States. It's essentially run by government, healthcare. It's a healthcare, government, and education city. Those are the big jobs in San Diego. And it's nowhere like LA that is urban and big and a city that is tougher and more expensive, maybe to live in. San Diego is also very expensive, but as I say, you get what you pay for. So I looked uh, in March at UCLA. It's a great school. Uh, I'd love to go there, but I better see myself at UC San Diego and better yet, San Diego State. That's the school that I've chosen that I'm working to uh, to get to in two years. Now the credits or the classes that I established today, I'm going to take 14 hours my first semester, 17 the second and 16 the third, the way it's set up now, all subject to change. Um, all of those credits that I have chosen are totally general and transferable to a California school. Uh, so that's the plan. Two years here, two years there, graduate, go out, get a seven-figure job, and buy a bunch of nice cars. Apologize for that long clip, but I did want to get that straightened out. Uh, yes, California schools are still planned, but doing four years there, I see myself wasting a lot of time, and right now, I don't know what I want to do. I love architecture, I love aeronautics, I love technology. Now, there's a lot of overlap in those three fields, but I cannot pinpoint what I want to do right now. And it would be hard for me to select a major, work on all these classes, and then figure out that's not what I want to do. And then have to start over and waste a lot of time, credit hours, and money uh, figuring that out. I'd like to do college in four years, not six, five, eight, seven, whatever. So that's the plan right now, and that took all the energy I had left to explain that. So hopefully um, 
hopefully that can clear a couple things up. That's it for me today, and I'll talk to you guys tomorrow morning on Saturday. Actually, it is today, Saturday the 9th or something. June 9th already? Holy crap, seven days. Talk to you guys later. Bye. Good night. Going to bed.